Hey guys, it is Arika Misha, and today I will be cooking my chicken a la queen. That's right, you heard me right. Chicken a la queen. I know y'all done heard about the king, but the chicken a la king, but today it's the chicken a la queen, boo. Yes, Google it, there is such a thing. But I'll be doing it the way I want to do it. The quick and easy way. Chicken a la queen. Because I am a queen. Word of the day. Remember, you are a queen. Gotta guard your heart, protect yourself. And let God protect you as well. You are a queen. Don't let nobody treat you like nothing else. That's right, baby. I'm a queen. You ain't gonna treat me any kind of way. The devil is a lie. Alright, let's get into this cooking, y'all. Don't get me started. <laughs> Alright y'all, let me show y'all a little cute little quick ingredients. Um, I've got some blue bonnet, uh, one stick of butter. I've got some steamed uh, mixed veggies. You can like put it in the microwave, make it real quick, but I'm going to put it in our food. And uh, this is the carrot, corn, peas, green beans, and lima beans. Ooh, that's a whole lot of green going on. We'll see about that. Alright, I've got some milk. I've got the college in chicken broth. Got some chicken broth. And I have the Purdue. I love this. I love this. Uh, the Purdue shortcuts. I get the grilled southern western style carved chicken breast. I love these because it's nice grilled chicken. And it's got, that, it's got its own flavor. You don't need to season the chicken. They've already got it all pre-seasoned for you. Really good. I've got three bags of those. Let me see. Oh, there it is. It is the 8 ounce bag. Y'all see it right here. 8 ounce bag. So I have three of these. And basically, I'm just going to uh, chop the chicken up. Because it's like pretty big pieces of chicken. Long pieces. I'm just going to chop them up. Y'all see how I do it. But those are simple, easy ingredients. And I got the flour. I forgot to put the flour on the table. But whatever you are. Flour too. Y'all will see me add everything. All right. Today, chicken a la queen. Let's get into it. Okay, guys. We've got our butter in my pan. And it is melting. So I'm going to go ahead and get that together that's your full stick of butter gonna go ahead and get that all nice and melted shouldn't take long go ahead and melt your one stick of butter you kind of chop it up to help it get melted This is quick and easy, guys. Quick and easy recipe for the chicken a la queen. All right, so we've got our one stick of butter in there melting. All right, the next thing you want to do, uh, you want to do half a cup of flour. Because you know the flour, that's for the thickening. So. half a cup of flour in there get that all mixed up that flour is going to help you know our chicken a la queen thicken up let me make sure y'all can see hold on y'all let me zoom y'all in a little bit more okay all right got our butter and flour blending together all right, that's good. Nice and thick and together. All right. Okay, now let's pour in two cups of chicken broth. Two cups of chicken broth. One cup. Two cups. All right, so that's one stick of butter, half a cup of flour, and two cups of chicken broth. All right, let's get that mixed up. All right, get that all mixed up together. Smells good already, that chicken broth. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I can't wait to add the chicken and the vegetables. 
well the vegetables minus the greens got my spoon here mixing everything up I think I'm gonna change my spoon let me see I think I'm gonna get a fork hold on y'all let me grab a fork So we can get that flour all broken up down in there. Okay, all right, broken up enough. All right, so, all right, next thing we need to do, one and a half cup of milk. One and a half cup of milk, all right? One cup, half a cup, uh -oh. all right. One and a half cup of milk. Right, let's get that all mixed up. All right, and the next thing we're gonna add our vegetables and my chicken. I got that all in one bowl, and I'll sh sh let you guys see how I got the um, chicken all nicely chopped up. And this is a nice, quick, easy chicken olive queen. So, you guys see how I got the chicken all nice and chopped up? Make sure y'all can see that. All nice and chopped up. We're going to get that in there. And I've got my veggies at the bottom. Just pouring it all in there. Everybody going in. Look and eat. Look at that. That looks delicious. And it's not even done yet. Look at that. Let me zoom y'all into that chicken a la queen. Look at it. Looks delicious. So good. I'm just going to stir everything together until everybody is getting along. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Y'all already know I got my seasons lined up over here so I can add my seasons to this. Let me go ahead and do that now, but it looks delicious already by itself. Mm -mm -mm. Let me add my seasons. Okay, first thing I'm going to add, and you guys can do a tablespoon of each season. About a tablespoon of salt. I'm doing about a tablespoon of garlic powder. All right. Tablespoon of onion powder. And I'll taste it to see if I need to add anything else. Right, and I'm also going to do a tablespoon of the Goya adobo all-purpose seasoning. Do a tablespoon of that. Alright. see what else we're going to do. I'm going to do a tablespoon of this kicking chicken seasoning by Weber chicken chicken seasoning I'm gonna add that I think that would taste really good in this olive king I'm gonna do a tablespoon of that so it gives it a little spice gives it a little kick just a little bit it's like a chicken season but then it has a really light spice all right and we're gonna do a tablespoon of pepper Get our pepper in there and of course my parsley. We'll do a tablespoon of parsley as well. Y'all know parsley. You gotta be in on it. So you get parsley in about a tablespoon of parsley for color. Alright. Now let's get it all mixed up. Get my stove cleaned off. Alright. Let's get it all mixed up. 
Mm, mm, mm. It smells delicious. A quick and easy chicken a la queen. And it kind of reminds you of uh, the fillings for a chicken pot pie. I mean, really, that's really all it is. Same thing, just like the fillings of a chicken pot pie. You're just missing your pie crust. But that's pretty much what this is to me. And you can put this over rice, over biscuits. We're going to have it over uh, homemade biscuits. I'm going to make that a separate video. You guys can check that video out as well. Uh, my homemade biscuits. We're going to have the chicken a la queen over some homemade butter biscuits. And like I said, you can have this over anything. You can just have it by itself. You can have it over rice, biscuits, whatever you want, bread, whatever you want to have it over. Mm, mm, mm. Let me see how it tastes. It tastes good. Let me see. Let me taste a piece of chicken. That'll really let me know. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, that's good. That's really, really good. Might need to add a little bit. Mm. I need to add a little bit more seasons. I need to add a little bit more salt. Still a little bland. I'm not getting all my seasons. Add a little bit more salt. Add a little bit more of the um, the um, kicking chicken. Add a little bit more of that. A lot more of that. Because that's what I really want to bring in. Alright, I'm going to add some more onion powder and garlic powder. I need to add a little bit more. About another tablespoon is what I'm adding. Let's get this mixed up because I know what flavor I'm going for. Mm, 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 mm. So good, you guys. And this is quick and easy. Y'all saw how fast I fixed this? Fixed it in like what, five minutes? Five minutes. That's why I got the pre cut, pre grilled, already cooked chicken, frozen vegetables. Just throw it in there. Do it all in the same pot. One stick of butter, just throw it all in there. And that's it. You see how it tastes now. Oh yeah, that's perfect. And that's it, you guys. Let me zoom y'all in. I want to give y'all a really good look at it. And that is... Let me see. Hold on. Let me get y'all. And that is the chicken a la queen. Cooked by a queen. Quick and easy meal, you guys. Look at that. With all those healthy, wonderful, delicious looking veggies in there. Ugh, yummy. Yes. Chicken a la queen. All right. Well, y'all seen me do it. So you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.